Hello, 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 and welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kiona, and I mainly do diamond painting content. So today, we have an unbagging, not an unboxing, an unbagging, from Unimade. I bought these back in April. I think it was April 26th, April 27th, and I'm finally getting to a point to where I'm bagging them. They are two different paintings. We have two toolkits, and <laughs> Tiny's already making noise. Tiny is Princess Peach. You've probably seen her in pre previous videos. Either way, let's just jump into this pink one. I don't remember which one's which, but I do know which one the kits come with. So we're going to figure out which one this one is. Go through this. Uh, and, um, yeah. If you notice, I got the bags. I paid extra for. I paid extra for the premium toolkits. I wanted the whole experience. And they were on sale when I bought them. And they're her snack size ones. The first original snack size ones. And don't mind the bags being dirty. That's my house. Um, they have just been moved every which way all over this house since I got them. Either way, they did come quick. Let's jump into this. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Alright. This one is this one. There we go. This is Rainbow Cloud by Star Winksy. This was her first one she ever released, which we're going to go through the premium toolkit first one. I love these bags. I love organza bags. We got a fluffy pin, which I will use. I like pins. We got a cover minder, which will become my magnet. Magnet. Here, let's get up close and personal, please. Whee! Maybe I should sit down. Don't mind me, I'll move my roller. You can see my roller. Just barely. It was on my chair. Okay, we got a... Looks like a little... Hubert style? I call it Hubert style. I don't know. It might be a little bright. There you go. We got another one in here that is like grid style, but pink. And a nice cute little rolls of washi tape. Hmm. Then we got some blue wax in a diamond-shaped caddy, it looks like. Yes. We got a seven-placer, a purple pen with a four-placer. Purple tweezers is what I was after. I wanted more purple. I love purple. Purple is not my favorite color, but it's up there. And then the easiest way to get a Muni Maid tray, and I only had one small one, I lost the lid, is through their premium toolkits. And so it's a blue one. So that gets me one light color. And that's actually why I chose these two paintings besides the cell, is I wanted one light color and one dark color for the toolkit. So this is the premium toolkit for the Rainbow Cloud by Starwingsy. Let's get that out of the way. We're not getting it out of the way. Hold on, I need to take a sip, sip of coffee. If there's a video where I'm not drinking coffee, send help. <laughs> okay, let me just throw all this back in the bag. <laughs> not the bubble wrap. Put that over there. Because the... Main reason I got the premium toolkit, this right here, is not going back in the bag. Got a different home going. Okay, so let's move this out of the way. And while we're up close and personal, oh, it's sealed. It is sealed, so I'm going to need some skizzers. Skizzers! Do I have a pair of skizzers nearby? I was not prepared. Who keeps skizzers nearby? Ma'am, have you seen my skizzers? Yes, I'm talking to my cat like she can't answer me. She's looking at me like, are you crazy? Hmm. Are they underneath my keyboard? Haha! A pair of scissors. I had one of those rolling carts with the tabletop, and the tabletop was over the scissors. Haha. -ha. Yes, I know it's scissors. I've just always called it scissors. And there's more people who do that, so I'm not alone in that. We're just going to do that. It's not going back in here. It'll go back in that, though. Okay. Let's see. It's tied pretty. It's such a shame, but I'm going to ruin you. Yeah. 
now we are going to pull this out. We'll look at all the includes here. We got a canvas with poured glue. We have hmm, haha, a informational sheet. Thank you so much for purchasing a Muni Made brand diamond painting kit. We are so excited to be embarking embarking on this new phase in our business. And just a whole bunch of stuff. I am not reading it all. Okay? It's got instructions how to diamond paint though. It's got their policies, including licensing all their kits, and how they have hand charted rendering. Uh, we know D stashes are common. I like this reselling. We know D stashes are common where people trade and sell collectible and discontinued art, but we kindly ask you not to price gouge. If we suspect that your intent is to purchase and resell at an inflated price when it is out of stock, we will not hesitate to ban you from future, future purchases in the store. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. All this other stuff. Yeah, okay. Here's our baggies. Bag. It's baggies of drills, which I am not a baggie person, and I really prefer them not coming in baggies, because that means more static when I go to kit up. And it looks like they are not in order. I am not going to go through these colors, because of the fact that, again, baggies. Such a shame, but let's see. We're going to have to do a kit up of one of these, so you guys can... Check it out. I see an A, B in there. But the quality looks good from through the bag. Like I said, I'm not going to unbag it. There's the palette. Okay. Now, you know this part of the video. This is where if you have planned to get this diamond painting. We're going to roll this back so we can see it better. But. If you plan on getting this diamond painting and you're like me and you like to special drill your diamond paintings, uh, this is your chance to take a screenshot of the color list so you can know which ones to replace. And just like a regular diamond painting, you can roll it backwards. But be careful because they are stickers. There we go. Since they are stickers, they can peel off when you roll backwards like that. But what do we got? I am still too much. There we go. Bit this is your time to screenshot. We got 32 colors with 1AB down at the bottom here, 5200. Um, the symbols look good. Just looking for any that can be mistaken. Now, I have issues with the slash and the check mark, but with the check mark being white and the slash being blue, I shouldn't have an issue with that. Um,. Again, you have this, uh, looks like a Mercedes symbol, but you also have this one, and again, the color is different enough, along with the little tint down here. If the color is different enough, you shouldn't have a problem. And we got the three dots and the four dots, or the four diamonds and the three dots. Again, colored. I like the colors are different. We do have an eight being three here, and a four being eight, but... That is nitpicking. Meow. That's my cat meowing. And I'm meowing back at her. I'm just double checking the symbols right now. Like I said, this is your chance to screenshot. We got a dot with a round around it and a dot regular. But again, colors, colors. Okay, so this is a square diamond painting. It's a 30 by 30. It's a nice snack size, like I said before. You have your title of the work, uh, the artist, Star Wingsy, start and end date. I mean, I will cut this down with my guillotine cutter to fit in my logbook, and I'd probably leave that out because it's so big. Like I said, this is a full sheet. The labels are... An... That's my phone! Sorry, we had somebody do a jump. She's going to make an appearance real quick. She's going to check out the diamond painting while I fix the keyboard. <laughs> Ma'am. 
She approves. She approves. Okay. You can't lay there. Mommy's busy. She likes a lot of attention. Don't mind her. Okay, so now that we've looked at this, let's take a look at the canvas. Now that I've been interrupted by a Princess Peach, or a Tiny, with this being poured glue, you can roll it backwards. It's got a nice felt-like backing. I'm not going to go through all these details the second time with the second painting. We're just going to go through them. Let's see. A uh, little bit further out. Here we go. I believe she said this used to be an emote on her Twitch channel. And it was the first one that she did all the testing with. And she did go through and clean up the rendering a lot. It looks good. We had that one AB, which is a triangle. Ma'am, you're going to help? Okay. The symbols are very, very clear. Doesn't look like I will have any issues with those few that I mentioned. Like I said, the colors being different helps a lot. What I'm going to have issues with is a cat. Okay, let's see where these ABs are. We have them over here, like a sparkle. Over here. A little bit around the edge of the cloud face. Yes, yeah, just sprinkled along the edge, like pop at me. Haha, <laughs> ma'am. We got some right here. And right here. That's where your ABs are for this kit. Oh, look, there's a little bit around the star right there and there. And the eyes. Okay. Like a lot of the companies, you know, you got the name of the company up at the top, Muni Made. You have a legend on the left and on the right. You have the title, the artist. This is copyright Star Winksy and Muni Made. Uh, Muni Made's website, uh, the artist social. Looks like her Twitter, size, and all that. So, let me wrap this up. I'm not going to be able to get rid of this cat. Let me wrap this up, and we'll be back with the toolkit for the next one. We are back with the blue one, which here is a premium toolkit for that. Ignore the ribbon. I did not put it back on. Tiny's going to help us go through this toolkit. This is the premium toolkit for this diamond painting, which I'm going to tell you which one it is. Did I get wax on it? I got wax on it. Is that when I was working on scented waxes, but ignore that. Okay. We have a novelty pin. This one with diamonds instead of floofies. I like the floofies better. The same purple pin, which means we have another seven placer in there. There we go. Ooh, I just threw a bunch of these out. It looks like we only get one washi tape, but it's a bigger roll, and it is gold foil mushrooms. Up close and personal. Gold foil mushrooms. Look at that. And we get a blue diamond this time instead of a pink one with blue wax. And another star magnet. I call it a magnet. I know it's a cover reminder. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that si that magnet off. And I'm going to repurpose it, the second magnet, not the first one. And I'm just going to put these on mine. And then we got our purple tweezers, which I love. And with this one, you get the purple mini. Like I said, small. Da, 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 da. What's it called? Time painting tray. Okay, sorry, I was moving that all around, or all the way. Put it up. This is what matters right here. This is why I paid the extra $20. <laughs> I'll be honest. Right here. All the other stuff is nice. This is what I wanted. This is a purple small mini made tray. And I love purple. Oh, the best part, if y'all didn't know my shop colors, my brand colors, all my colors, they are these two colors. It's so on brand for me. So it's so perfect. This is another reason I chose what I chose. Let's see if I can scroll out. You'll see a cat probably. You scroll out enough, you got a cat sitting right here, and you got my shop sticker, which are the same colors. Okay, we'll move that off to the side, and we will open up this dining painting so we can see which one it is, because I already forgot. 
Yes, I paid for, this is the medium dust cover, which happened to be blue. And I paid for the extra. This is a round Winston's Prize by Cute But Weird. This is a 40 by 40, so it's a little bit bigger. I know, I know. I'm not showing y'all up close and personal. Well, I'm trying to get this plastic off. Are you the mascot now? She says yes. Yes, I am. I'm going to go ahead and do this now. This is what I did to the other one. I just wrapped it around the dust bag, because our dust cover, because I'm not going to keep the ribbon. That way I know which one's which. And we pull it open. I've never been good with bows. Don't worry, she doesn't play with things. Let's grab our stuff out. Hey, I gotta actually grab it out. You got your canvas, your drills, your instructions and info. And we're not gonna um, roll this backwards this time because I gotta put it back up. We have our sticker sheet, which we're gonna zoom in. I'll say out. We have an out. Hey. As before, this is your moment to take a screenshot if you want to know the colors in order to customize it yourself with your own special drills. Here, so you see the Winston Prize as best as I can. I'm holding the top up, that's why. Okay. There's your champ. Now we have 31 colors in this with two ABs. This is Winston's Prize by Cuba Weird. From Muni Made, start end date, diamond, diamond shape round, 40 by 40, also known as 15.7 by 15.7. I think this is the second one she released. That's why the SKU is MMR02. Let's see. Let's look. If we're going to have some fun. Again, we have the triple dots and the four diamonds, which, again, uh, enough difference in colors that it shouldn't be an issue. Excuse me. I keep burping. The five is, are the eight. Number eight is a five. Number 14 is a three. This is things that might mess with you. Cause it messes with me. Uh, 19 is, a, or sorry, you have the tint and the Y. But if you're paying enough close attention, the color is different enough. Again, the slash and the check mark. But you have a light, a light green and like a mint green. And then the white so it's on it's a non issue. Uh, yeah, looks like we're pretty good. Well you have the X and the tent, but again different colors. So we've had enough time with that. Let's look at the drills. Here's your color palette. Let me spread them out a little bit. There's your color palette. Let's look at the quality here. We got an A B up here. We'll look at the quality while we have a chance. It looks like good quality. Maybe a couple dimples I just saw, but no tags, no trash bits that are standing out. I do have a stray drill running around, a couple of them. So I might have to check to make sure this is closed and doesn't have any holes in it because it looks like it is the white A B. See it right there. But I'm not going to pull the drills out for obvious reasons. If you are if you don't remember from the previous one, just go back a few minutes. This is why I don't like baggies. I prefer them coming on in the string. They're a lot easier to put up. Okay. Now, it's time to flip it around and roll it up. And then I will scroll out so you can see Miss Peach over here judging me. I send that out. I have my gloves on because my carpal tunnel is acting up. Don't mind me. My carpal tunnel and hand cramps. Double whammy. Here's our cute but weird. Place. Do you approve? No. Yeah. Do you approve? She approves. Alright, R, A, Bs are an up arrow and a triangle. 
It looks like that triangle is her generic white for the AB, just like her check mark looks like her 5200 each time. So we have this star right here, all the twinkles. Having fun clicking the twinkles. This star, this star, this star, twinkle, twinkle. Whatever, it just looks like pieces of grass. All oh, that's your white AB. And it looks like. I do have one concern. The K in the eyes is a little hard to see. That's that. That's number six, the 333. Three, three. I'll show you in a minute. We'll get close, per close and personal. I'll show you why. There's a couple of them, too. It's not just the K. But we got our black ABs and the eyes and the nose and the cheeks. Oh, look, there's a little white AB, too. Yep, 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 yep. If they weren't a different color, the three dots is actually kind of confusing with the triangle, but not too much. I use a light pad no matter what because of how bad my eyes are. But the color is enough of a difference it wouldn't make an issue. So let me scroll in and show you my two issues. And it might not be an issue for you, but it's a total issue for me. And I think I'm going to look into the other painting. It's just I noticed it right off the bat. I'm having this issue with paint gym painting. That's the only reason I got it fresh on my brain. Can we bring you even closer so I can really show you? Okay. So. I'm going to get close and personal here. If you look right in here this color right here the eight it is a little bit darker of a purple i would have gone with a white text instead of a black text there and i had the same problem what was it where did i see it i had the same problem with the k <laughs> Oh, there it is. It's all in the stump. So, if you look at the K, there you go, up close and personal, right? So, if you look at right there, the K is a black on that dark, it, the medium colors, it's a black symbol instead of a white, and I would have preferred a white because then for people like me, where it's easier, you know, we got a little bit of vision issues, that right there, those two symbols are going to require me to use a light pad. And actually, now that I'm looking at it, there's this swirly one right down in the grass. Same issue. But that is my only issues with this. And again, I might have to go back and look at the other one. But yeah, let me roll this up and we'll be back with the other one real quick to look. Okay, now some of y'all may say that I'm nitpicking here. I just put that up. I didn't even open this up yet. Some of y'all may say that I'm nitpicking here, but it's actually something I didn't realize was an issue until recently. Like I said, when doing a paint gem kit, they had a medium pink with a black T. I can't see it. Even, or I didn't have a light pad because I was doing it straight on top of this. So we're going to look right here, see if we have the same issue. We actually do with that same purple. Let me guess. 333? No, this is 208. 208, you have the same issue. I'm sorry, it's a little dark. But you see where it's a medium color. And on the outside here, the E's, which are 161. It's a medium blue with a black letter. And same thing around the, the moons, around the star, which is 400. That is a medium color with a black letter. Again, this was not an issue for a while for me. We got a couple more. We got this one right here. Until I did that um, paint gem kit. But if you look, this is what I'm talking about. So right there, we're going to use that right there. Between the pink, uh, the purple, and uh, the red and the orange. You see how that red, that equal sign? has white and it's about the same tone level or brightness level as that orange next to it but the orange has the black you see the difference in legibility right there so yeah that's my only issue and again i'll be using a light pad so 
it should be a non-issue as long as I have my light pad. But I just want y'all to... Ma'am. <laughs> I just want y'all to be clear of that, that that is a thing. And, again, I've never really noticed it until I started doing a paint gym kit, and I didn't have a light pad for once. And I was like, oh my god, I cannot see this letter. Besides those me nitpicking things, honestly, I'm really excited to try uh, Mini Maid kits. I really am. I might have to push it ahead in the list. What do you think, Tiny? Ma'am? Yeah, she said yeah. She meowed at me. I don't know, you also picked it up. She's very quiet. Move her closer. There you go. Now you can see her. Meow. Either way, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. I thank you for watching this video of me unbagging two Muni Made paintings. I need to try these out to see if I'm going to go buy some more. And I recommend if you just want to try it out, because it is a little higher in the price point, to try one of her snack size kit. Save a little money it, just to try it out because you never know what you might like. It's like there's another company I've tried recently that I did one of their kits at the very beginning of the year and it's not my favorite but I only bought two small kits so it's not like I'm stuck with stuff I don't want to do. In fact I'm going to give the other one a try here soon. So if you want to try them I recommend actually going for this smaller one. The uh, square rainbow cloud by Star Winksy, or if you are more round, you 40 by 40, uh, the Winston's Prize by Cute by Weird. These would be what I would do as, or what I am going to do, is a good trial of square and round for Muni Maid, and I will actually end up doing, not maybe a post review, but when I kit these up, or kit, or when I kit these down, not kit them up, when I kit these down after doing them, I will, um, ma'am, <laughs> I will uh, go ahead and tell you how I felt about them. Either way, this cat has tried to steal the spotlight, so I'm going to let y'all go. If y'all enjoyed what you saw today, leave a thumbs up. If you want to see more like this, or if you have any comments about this, sorry, if you have any comments about Muni Made, if maybe you have the same issue with medium colors and black text, or if I'm be you think I'm being too critical, leave a comment down below. Usually I'm not that critical. Come on, it's just over something that's very, that's more me. And if you want to see more like this and you like my personality and my attitude about things, go ahead and click on my face. It's right about there. To subscribe. Either way, I'm going to let you all go because I have to get this cat off my table because she's just cleaning herself. Y'all have a wonderful day. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.